Magandang araw mga bata. Ngayon, pag-aralan natin about visualizes percent and its relationship to fractions, ratio, and decimal numbers using models. Defines percentage rate or percent and base. Identify the base, percentage, and rate in a problem. These are the objectives. The learners are expected to 1. Visualize percent and its relationship to fractions, ratios, and decimal numbers using models. 2. Defines percentage, rate, or percent, and base. 3. Identifies the base, percentage, and a rate in a problem. 4. Appreciate the use of percent, rate, and base in a real-life situation. It was in the 15th century when the idea of percent began. It came from the Latin word per centrum, which means for every hundred. A percent is a ratio of a number to 100. It is represented by the symbol percent. Complete the table by writing the number word in fraction and decimal forms. Write your answer under the proper column. Number 1, 82 hundredths, 82 hundredths in decimal, 82% in percent, 82 over 100 or 41 over 50 in fraction form. Number 2, 75 hundredths in decimal, 75 hundredths in percent, 75%. In fraction, 75 over 100 or 3 fourths. Number 3, 2 hundredths. In decimal, 2 hundredths. Percent, 2 percent. Fraction, 2 over 100 or 1 over 50. Number 4, 15 hundredths. In decimal, 15 hundredths. Percent, 15 percent. Fraction, 15 over 100 or 3 over 20. Number 5, 9 hundredths. In decimal, 9 hundredths. Percent, 9 percent. Fraction, 9 over 100. Read and understand the problem. Francis practices basketball every day. He makes 82 percent of the total shots he attempts to make in a day. If he attempted a total of 100 shots today, how many shots was he able to make? So, this is the illustration of the shots. Out of 100, the shaded parts are 82. So, we can write in percent, 82%, fraction, 82 over 100, and in decimal, 82 hundredths. Compare the shaded part in each grid. So the first one, there are 35 shaded parts. So in percent, 35 percent. In the second one, can be written in ratio 35 is to 100. Then in decimal, 35 hundredths. And in fraction form, 35 over 100. Changing percent to fraction. Number one, 42 percent in fraction form, 42 over 100, and can be expressed in lowest term as 21 over 50. Number two, 9 percent in fraction form, 9 over 100, and in lowest term, 9 over 100. Number three, 25 percent. In fraction form, 25 over 100. And in lowest term, 1 fourth. Number 4, 16%. In fraction form, 16 over 100. In lowest term, 4 over 25. Changing percent to decimal. Percent may be also be written as a decimal number. To change percent to decimal, write the percent as a fraction. Then, divide the numerator by the denominator. Example number 1, 15% in fraction form, 15 over 100. In decimal, 15 hundredths. 
Number 2, 9% in fraction form, 9 over 100 in decimal, 9 hundredths. Number 3, 13% in fraction form, 13 over 100 in decimal, 13 hundredths. Another way of changing percent to decimal, change percent symbol to decimal point, then move it twice to the left. Example number 1, 15%. So yung decimal after ng, nasa gitna ng 5 at percent, so move 2 to the left, the answer is 15 hundredths. Number 2, 9%, change to decimal, move 2 places to the left, the answer is 9 hundredths. Number 3, 68%. So move 2 places to the left. The answer is 68 hundredths. Changing percent to ratio. Example number 1, 27%. So in ratio that is 27 is to 100. Number 2, 5%. In ratio that is 5 is to 100. Number 3, 87%. In ratio 87 is to 100. And number 4, 1% in ratio form is 1 is to 100. So, percent is a ratio with 100 as the second term. So, to change percent to ratio, remove the percent sign and then write 100 as the second term. Base, percentage, and rate. So, let's have this example. 85% of 40 pupils of Mrs. Porras attended her mathematics class. How many pupils attended the class? The number sentence in this problem is 85% of 40 is blank. What is the missing part in the mathematical sentence? Letter A, how many pupils did Mrs. Porras have in all? The answer is 40 is a whole or total number it is called base letter b many percent of the pupils attended the mathematics class answer 85 percent is the rate which can be expressed as a ratio or a fraction 11 letter c how many pupils attended the mathematics class answer 34 is 85 percent of 40 34 is the percentage it is a part of the whole. Therefore, the missing element is the percentage. Study these examples. 15% of 60 is 9. 15% is the rate. 60 the base. 9 the percentage. 15% is the rate. It is given as part. It can be expressed as a ratio or as a fraction. Rate is the number with the sign percent. 60 is called the base. It is the whole or which you can take the percent. Base is the number that usually follows the phrase percent of. 9 is called the percentage, meaning part of the whole. Percentage at a constant rate is directly proportional with base. In symbol, P equals R times B, where P is the percentage rate is R and B is the base. Another example, 88 is 15, 55% of 160. So let's identify the parts. The rate is 55%, the base 160, the percentage 88. Write the name for each shaded part as a fraction, as a decimal, as a percent, and as a ratio. So in this figure, in fraction form, 12 over 25. In decimal form, 48 hundredths. In percent form, 48 percent. In ratio form, 48 is to 100. In this figure, there are 36 out of 100. So in Fraction form, 36 over 100. Decimal form, 36 hundredths. In percent form, 36 hundred percent. In ratio form, 36 is to 100. In this figure, there are 56 shaded parts. So, in fraction form, 
56 over 100, in decimal, 56 hundredths, in percent, 56 percent, in ratio, 56 is to 100. In this figure, there are 30 shaded parts. So, in fraction form, 30 over 100. In decimal form, 30 hundredths. In percent form, 30 hundred, 30 percent, sorry, 30 percent. In ratio form, 30 is to 100. In this figure, there are 60 shaded parts. So, in fraction form, 60 over 100. In decimal form, 60 hundredths. In percent form, 60 percent. In ratio form, 60 is to 100. In this figure, there are 20 shaded parts. So, can be written as fraction as 20 over 100. In decimal, 20 hundredths. In percent, 20 percent. In ratio, 20 is to 100. Write the ratio, decimal, and percent equivalent of each picture. So, lahat, 100 yung picture. Una, triangle. There are 25 triangles. So, in ratio form, 25 is to 100. Decimal, 25 hundredths. Percent, 25 percent. Next is flower. There are 12 flowers. So, in ratio form, 12 is to 100. Decimal, 12 hundredths, percent, 12 percent. Heart, there are 35, so 35 is to 100 in ratio form. Decimal, 35 hundredths, percent, 35 percent. Arrow, there are 20. Uh, or plain, or plain by yan. So there are 20, so in ratio form, 20 is to 100. Decimal, 20 hundredths, percent. 20%. Okay, that is mali. So, dapat ay 20%. 20 and 20%. Next one is moon. Moon, there are 8. So, 8 is to 100. Decimal, 8 hundredths and percent, 8 percent. Write rate, base, or percentage on the blank to identify what element is missing. So, 80, so tandaan natin yung sentence, blank is, percentage is, rate then of base. So, 80 is 15% of what number? So, after of, that is the base. Number 2, what is 75% of 100? So, yung what is the percentage followed by rate then base. 2 is what percent? So, kapag tinatanong what percent, that is the rate. Number 4, 12 is 20% of what number? So, after ng of, that is the base. Number 5, what percent? So, percent is the rate. Complete the table. Reduce the fractions to lowest term if possible. Number 1, 37%. In ratio form, 37 is to 100. In fraction form, 37 over 100. In decimal, 37 hundredths. Number 2, the given in ratio is 17 is to 100. So, in percent form, 17%. Fraction, 17 over 100. In decimal, 17 hundredths. Number 3, the decimal is 1. 1 whole, ibig sabihin that is 100%. In ratio, 100 is to 100 or 1 is to 1. Fraction is 100 over 100 or 1. Over 1 or 1. Number 4, 34 over 100 in percent, 34 percent, ratio, 34 is to 100. In decimal, that is 34 hundredths. Number 5, in the given, 9 hundredths in decimal. In percent, 9 is to 100, 9 percent, ratio, 9 is to 100. Fraction, 9 over 100. Identify the base rate and percentage. Number 1, the rate is 20%, the base 40, percentage 8. Number 2, the rate is 45%, base 1,200, percentage 540. Number 3, the rate is 13%, base 300, percentage 39. 
Number 4, the rate is 85%. The base is 40. The percentage is 34. Number 5, the rate is 30%. The base is 120. The percentage is 36. Yan lang ang topic natin ngayon mga bata. Sana may natutunan kayo sa uh, ipinakita ko po ngayon. So, kung kayo ay bago sa aking channel, don't forget to subscribe. Thank you. Bye-bye!